Hi everybody, this is Karen Hooley and I'm recording a little bit of a video for you to uh, figure out the edging on my mystery shawl crochet along. And I know a few of you have had a little bit of trouble with that edging, it's only one row, but I want to make sure that you understand what I'm talking about. So I have just completed here three repeats of row 54. Um, I just did three repeats just so that I could show you what was going on. And um, row 55 is about to start, so we're going to go ahead and pick up our hook. And if you're left-handed, just reverse what I'm doing here for you. But row 55 says chain one and turn. So chain one and turn. Then it says to uh, single crochet in the second double crochet. So this is my first right here. Here's number two. So I'm going to do a single crochet in there. Then it says, in parentheses, chain three, skip next two double crochets, double crochet, next double crochet, and then end of the parentheses, and it tells you to do that twice. So you're going to chain three, skip two double crochets, double crochet in the, the next double crochet. Then you get chain three again. Then you skip two. And double crochet in that last double crochet. You'll notice that double this double crochet I'm doing right now is going into the very last double crochet of the eight double crochet group at the end of the row. Then it says to chain three and turn. So I'm going to turn and then it says to skip the two chain three spaces we just made. So we're going to skip this guy and we're going to skip this guy. And it says double crochet in next single crochet. So my single crochet is way over here. So we're going to double crochet, insert into that, and that's the next step. So you'll notice that, that we did these double crochets here, but we're skipping way over them and we're making another chain space. I know it looks really sloppy right now but you should get be able to see what's happening on my next step. So we've done that. It says to chain three and turn again. So there's my chain three. I'm going to turn it again. And then it says three double crochets in the next chain three space. So if you look at what I just did, here's the chain three I just made before the turn. And here is the chain three space it's talking about, sitting right on top. So you're going to yarn over and do three double crochets in there. Two. And three. We need some more yarn here. Okay. So now, if you look at that, there's all those three double crochets inside that chain space. And it still looks kind of funky right here, but bear with me for a second. Okay, so now it says double crochet in the next double crochet. So if you look right here, there's a double crochet. You're gonna do a double crochet in there. And then it says three double crochets around the post of the same double crochet. So, this is actually the double crochet I worked in. This is, I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back so you guys can see this. So I just chain three and turned. I do my three double crochets in that space. One, two, and three. Okay, so there's those three. Now it says to double crochet in the top of the next double crochet, and I made a mistake when I was talk talking earlier. This is not the double crochet we're talking about. This is the double crochet, because if you look at this, this is actually a chain space from the previous row, so just ignore that. You're looking at this. It's basically the same spot. You're gonna double crochet right there at the top of it, see where this and this join. So you see that there? 
Then it says three double crochet around the same po the post of the same double crochet. So this is the double crochet. We just put the double crochet in. So you're just going to yarn over and put three double crochets right in there. So do you see that there now? Now I'm spreading them out just a little bit so you can kind of see what I did. So there's the three in this space. There's the one that's in the top of the stitch. And here's the three that are around the post. So they're all in a line. So if you're working here, this is not what you should be doing. You should be just working across here. Then it says skip next double crochet, which is right here. And then it says single crochet in the next double crochet. So we're moving over, we're skipping over that single double crochet here. And we're moving over to the next shell. So we're going to single crochet right there. And then we're going to follow the same instructions again. This time I'm going to do it and pause in between, but I'm not going to say anything so you can actually watch me do it. And there is that last single crochet before you do the next, I guess you could call them a sharp tooth on the edging. So I'm going to zoom in just a little bit. And you can see I've got the two edges right there. Now, if you have any questions, go ahead and post them on the bottom of this video. And I will do my best to answer your questions. Talk to you soon. Bye.